In this video, we'll talk about the battery mounting system on the X4. And as you may know, it's very similar to the battery mounting system from the T421. So it's fully adjustable and um, it comes like that in the kit, so you don't need any specific parts to make it work. But it is adjustable, which means that you have to adjust it in the right way. But I am gonna um, explain about a couple of optional parts, which you may require depending on the battery that you use. So, if you use a narrow battery pack, which is quite popular now, we recommend using these narrow graphite adjustable holders, which you need to, to be able to fit the narrow battery in the car. So, the standard parts look like this. They're fairly long, but these are a lot shorter, so for narrow batteries. The next thing about fitting different types of batteries that I want to mention is to use shorty batteries. If you want to use a shorty battery, I recommend that you'll use these um, brass optional shorty battery holders. They're also uh, weights, they're 40 grams each, so they, they add up for the, the light weight of the shorty pack. So these, they mount onto the car here in place of the regular style mounting system. It simply goes on top of these weights. So you just move these uh, mounts onto the weights and the weights mount onto the chassis like this. So that allows you to use a small shorty pack, which is often popular on uh, carpet tracks for modified racing. It's not really a thing in stock racing, but for modified racing, it's uh, rather popular. So those are the option parts for the battery mounting system covered. Let's see how we can set this up in the correct way. To do this, I'm gonna put the battery in the car, which I have a regular 2S long battery, uh, wide, but uh, low CG battery. So let's see if we can fit this in the car here. It's a very tight fit, so I'm gonna adjust the position of these carbon holders here. I'm gonna have to move them a little bit outwards to leave more space for the battery. Basically, the rule of thumb here is to always have the battery completely free. It cannot have any binding. Uh, it's better that it has a bit of play than that it's too tight, because the point of this battery mounting system is to have the battery basically free-floating, so that it doesn't affect the chassis specs of the car as much. So this has a very positive effect on the handling, that you have a free-floating battery. So we're gonna have a bit of play in all directions, from front to back, from left to right, there's actually a bit too much, but also to the top. So we're gonna have to adjust uh, the height of these holders as well to accommodate for the, the height of this battery. So I'm gonna turn these until they should not touch the battery, but they should be very close. So we have a little bit of upwards play, a little bit of play front to back. And finally, we're gonna adjust the, the play from side to side. As you can see, it's very easy to adjust the play in each direction with the adjustability of these battery mounts, which are included in the kit. Okay, so now we have a decent amount of play in all directions. Nothing is binding up. So I'm pretty happy with that. And having this play will prevent the battery mounting from affecting the handling of the car.
And I think that's it. That concludes uh, the battery mounting system.